Carolina. Browns 2-2, fly it into left center. Going back there is Ziska, that'll go over his head. Coming around third is Endweiler. Throw to the plate. It airmailed the catcher Jack Alexander, but a nice job by Brown to back it up, and it's a double for Michael Bush to put the Tar Heels up top, one nothing. And then on, on the other hand, we'll see it go out towards right from time to time. Here's another one driven deep to left field. Ziska turns and looks. Goodbye. North Carolina leads by three as Aaron Sabato hits his ninth of the year. Have to wonder if that has any effect on his tough beginning of the ball game. Grounded right up the middle by Martirano. Up with his Myers, but around third comes Soretti, and he's across the score of the Tar Heels' fourth run. Goes the other way to deep right center field. Off the wall. Gilgenbach overran it. Around third comes Bush. And Bush puts the Tar Heels back up by four runs as Sabato strides into second. The 1 1 from Brown. Driven to deep center field. Back goes Myers. Makes the play for out number two. Sabato tags and scores from third. And the Tar Heels up 6 to 1. Tied for first in the ACC and on base percentage, over 400. Driven to deep left field. Back goes Ziska to the track, and it's gone. Dylan Harris, the one and two count, doesn't care. Takes Cameron Brown deep. The second home run allowed by the junior lefty, and it's eight to one, Tar Heels. And as Cameron Brown approaches 90 pitches, there now is action in the Notre Dame bullpen as Zachary Dresden warms up. Driven in the air to left center. And North Carolina adds another home run as Danny Soretti goes yard. Nine to one, North Carolina leads. And for Danny Soretti, it's his first collegiate home run. The 0-2. Swung on, driven to left field. That'll bounce in front of Ziska. Freeman comes home. Harris scoots on to second. Tenth run of the night for the Tar Heels, and they're not done yet. 